Well, a group of co-workers were looking for a way to stay active on their lunch hour, which brought them to a sport known as pickleball. But pickleball is usually not played outdoors in the winter in Minnesota. But this year during a pandemic, it is. Betsy Moline has more in this week's Northwoods Adventure. It's been a little over a year since a group of 8 to 10 Sanford physical and occupational therapists decided to play pickleball each day during lunch. It wasn't their first group activity idea. We just knew that uh, we needed something to do over the noon hour just to, you know, blow off some steam. And uh, we, uh, it started out that we'd go running, uh, go for like a three mile run. And then, uh, then we come back, hit the showers. Then that evolved into ultimate frisbee, and uh, we did that for probably three years, three and a half years. And then we started with the pickleball halfway through uh, this past summer. Pickleball has proved for the group to be a great blend of competitive play and a fulfilling workout. Uh, you really get a good workout. My PT friends say that all the the sudden stopping and starting is really good for your joints. The scoring for pickleball varies from other racket-based games. Start off with a score of 0-0-2. Uh, you say your score first. Uh, the, the last number that you say is the number of serve, but you start off at 2. And then when you, uh, uh, when you don't score the point, then it goes to the other team and they they have two different chances to uh, score. Here at Algoma Park in Bemidji there are six pickleball courts. Usually this time of year it would be too cold to play but this year with an unseasonably warm January the league has taken it upon themselves to remove any snow to make sure that their courts are available to play. The group meets to play each day depending on the day it can be from two to ten people but eight is the magic number to allow for everyone to play. They feel lucky to be able to play this late into the year. Uh, this time of year it's supposed to be 20 below and we'd probably be inside. Uh, so we're just, we're totally lucking out on this weather and this is awesome. Once the weather gets too harsh, Mike does have plans for his lunch break. Probably just catch up on our paperwork. Reporting in Bemidji for this week's Northwoods Adventure, Betsy Moline, Lakeland News. I wish they'd shovel off those tennis courts outside. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> That'd be easier. Lakeland News is member supported content. Please consider supporting Lakeland News today.